in order to support our Moto Adventures and our vlogging ambitions, um, I have selected uh, the Insta360 X Pro cameras because they come up with a lot of features and also they give you the ability to record sound, for instance, using the DJI mic that I already presented to you. Uh, they are 4K cameras and they have some great features that are of uh, interest to me. Now, obviously, you got other options. You got the DJI options. Uh, I'm not very familiar with the ecosystem and also the um, GoPro. Uh, and GoPro, I have experience with it and it's been a bit uh, hit and miss. I like the fact that you can flip the screen to look at yourself when you're vlogging. Uh, and I like the fact that... Um, we have the same set of camera to check um, how things are going. Uh, the goal is very much also to be able to record in, in all conditions. And uh, this camera is second to none into capturing crisp footage in the dark. So something to look forward to as well. Now the Moto vlogging system is really what caught my attention. They have some quick release system that are magnet um, assisted, let's say. There's hooks, but the magnet uh, help you align everything very easily. Uh, and then you can attach a cold shoe to the side and this is where the DJI um, receptor comes to and attaches to. Uh, that's really compact, that's really easy, a minimalist kind of setup that you can attach to your helmet, to your motorbike or anywhere else. You need obviously a few options like the microphone attachment that you put to the side of the camera by removing a tiny door. Uh, but again, very easy plug and play uh, and then you click it into place and um, bobs your ankle. So once you have this, you can attach your receiver to the side um, of, uh, of the cold shoe. Uh, and with that, you can be connected directly into the camera's audio, which is very convenient. And that allows us to connect, for instance, two recept uh, receptors to in each of our helmets and record the audio directly into the camera when we're vlogging. So super convenient. Here's an example of how it's That's the speed limit. You've got my license, right? Cause yes. <laughs> so with that, you can set up the camera on your helmet, on your chest, on the handlebars, whichever way you want. You can tell that I still need to experiment a little bit with the field of view, especially when attached to the helmet, where I tend to look down a little bit too much. So I need to increase the field of view, but this is really promising and the quality of the footage is really, really, really good. So really happy with that purchase. And now, if you look at that footage, it was pitch black. And the camera is able to keep a very smooth footage uh, at night. Uh, it looks really crisp and smooth, a little bit too smooth even if you ask me, but exceptional footage for shooting in the dark, which is gonna be great because it means that we can extend uh, the type of content we can create uh, with those cameras when it comes to writing and sharing our adventures with people. So really, really excited about, about this. Obviously, I told you about the ambition to kind of do a film. And I think these cameras are going to be at the heart of uh, the productions um, that we're going to offer you uh, later this year. So again, Ace uh, Pro from uh, Insta360, you might want to check it out.